Hello, I'm Mel. I'm socialmediatraffic.com. This video is how to make your own YouTube channel art with your own pictures and photographs. I was confronted with the upgrade to the new YouTube one channel layout and the click here to get the new design. It looked fairly onerous and the recommendation was to get it made by a professional but I found a way to create my own quickly with what I had at hand with my own pictures. This is how I created my own channel art using my own pictures, Word document, Microsoft Paint and a free capture program called Jing. So here's what it looks like on my channel and I'll go through the steps I used so that you can adapt my method to your liking using your arrangement of your own pictures and text. It says get specifications for making channel art and I had to figure how I would get my pictures within these dimensions which would appear on each of the devices that they give measurements for this is the template you're given. This is the minimum size that can be uploaded to YouTube. And your pictures have to be fitting in this area here to be viewed on all the devices. Here's the desktop maximum, a tablet, and the desktop minimum, and for mobile devices. I opened my Word document and in the middle of the page I put one, two, three pictures from my pictures file and I had a space here in which I wanted my text and I had to make that into an image. I found I could not write my text beside the photograph and I did it like this. I opened another Word document, I moved the rulers out of the way. I then typed my text, formatted it and used the colors I wanted. I then took my Jing program, I captured that image and I saved it to my pictures file. I then used the insert button, found it in my pictures file and inserted it as an image here. That's one image and these are naturally separate images and these can be altered in size to suit so that you get the space you need for whatever your choice might be. Once I was satisfied with the arrangement of my pictures I used Jing again and I captured the entire page and I saved that to my desktop or pictures file. That's where I'll find it when I go to Microsoft Paint to upload it and resize it. We'll go to Paint now. I have opened Paint and I go to Paste and Paste From I go to my pictures folder and choose the captured image. I go to resize, click on pixels, I uncheck maintain aspect ratio, I replace both these figures with the minimum size I can upload to YouTube which is 2120 by 1192 I press OK I go to save as give it a name and save it to my pictures close the program I'm back here at my YouTube channel and I click here to get the new design I created scroll to the bottom, get started, 
click Add Channel Art, and I'll select that image I've just saved from Paint. I'll find it in my Pictures file. It's now uploading. It appears here. It's right in the center as I wanted, and it's shown here as it will appear in other devices. When I press adjust the crop, I find it doesn't move because it's at the very minimum which they will accept. I'll select that and there it appears. YouTube automatically puts this channel image up and space has to be left for that. I've got my four images across here and there is actually a space here which I could have utilized. Here is the editing drop down box for editing your channel art again and this edit and this edit is where this clickable link can be changed. There's also need to set your channel icon, describe your channel and put in a special video describing your channel. All this might be the subject of another video. But I hope this video showing just how to quickly get your own pictures up into your channel art area has been helpful. Thanks for watching. Social media traffic for tips and strategies get free instant access. Go now to my website imsocialmediatraffic.com